Hey, footy fans, I want to do a little post on uh, Rugby Union, the 15-man code. I've been a bit uh, slack on that front lately. Look, to be honest, I kind of lost interest in Super Rugby through the season, as did a lot of people. Of course, the Auckland Blues took out the title. They won at home, their first win since 2003, so well done to them. But now we're into international rugby season and uh, this weekend we see some uh, pretty interesting matchups. England are playing against the All Blacks in New Zealand, Australia v Wales in Sydney, uh, the Springboks up against Ireland um, in South Africa. The Springboks of course lost their Rugby World Cup pool match to Ireland before Ireland bombed out in the quarterfinals and South Africa won the tournament so there will be maybe a bit of revenge there. Uh, look, there are other ones going on. I have to confess, I don't even know who Argentina are playing, for example, um, or Scotland. Uh, maybe they're playing each other. That's a good good chance of that. But um, look, from an Australian perspective, uh, the Wallabies, this is their first game under new coach uh, Joe Schmidt, the first game since their disastrous 2023 Rugby World Cup. And interestingly, it is against Wales. Um, so really the train wreck that was the Eddie Jones Wallabies era 2023 and the Rugby World Cup in that year uh, reached its low point against Wales in the pool match with a thrash 40 points to six. Um, so um, chance for revenge here to very new squads. I think there's only three Wallabies likely to make the starting 15, at least if not the 23 who were in that match. Um, a whole bunch of fresh faces in the Wallabies. Uh, Joe Schmidt has ignored players based overseas. A couple of players who are signed on for the NRL for next season. So a lot of fresh faces, a lot of speculation who will be captain. Queenslander Liam Wright is one name being thrown around. Uh, the squads will be named uh, tomorrow. But look, um, hopefully the Wallabies from an Australian perspective can uh, in this two match series against Wales can get some respect back and win back some fans get some revenge if you like from that uh, disastrous 2023 World Cup game in the pool match against Wales uh, time will tell anyway bring it on uh, looking forward to this one and uh, and then on to the the um, broader international rugby season so can't wait until next time catch you in the middle of a rolling mall see ya